Hey, Arthur. What do you want? Uncle told me something about a train. <sighs> what did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows, just south of the state border. Yes. You need help with it? I ain't even sure about doing it. Come on. At night, not too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. <laughs> you know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is kind of brilliant. Uh, for you. <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna need ammunition, guns, look real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Gotta head into town for Abigail anyway. Don't even ask. You go find us an oil wagon. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. Hey, mister. Mister? Easy there. I'm talking. Say good night. Kill that bastard. Yes. For nothing.
Job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. I can scrap, Arthur. I'm just no good at homework. I can see. Besides, what do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I try to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please. Yeah? Grow up. And let me come on the raid with you. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns, you're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> me and the big cheeses, love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. Hey, all the horses untethered? I think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. You find a good spot, Wolfman? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. There's a spot that's remote, but should still give enough time to spot the oil wagon. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently. Picks up a new team of guards at the state line, so... Shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. Are you trying to kill those horses? See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Ha ha ha. You're a funny fella, John Marston. <laughs> Slow down. Yeah. They're left here, towards roads. What was they talking about? A lot of folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time, playing sick and fondling that new scar. Think you're gonna buy a breakfast in the morning. You're gonna run the horses to death. You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. Whoa! He's up on them horses! No, I was saying something. Oh, yeah. That could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's obsessing. Because oh, so I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. Too fast, Arthur. I blame you two for rescuing them. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this ride, and nobody needs to die here. Dead. Mr. Marsh. Mr. Smith, Mr. McGuire, ha! Get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I'll do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving.
join us on there. All right, get on that train. Bastard. All yours, Captain. Go on ahead. Taking a look yet? Chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. We'll take that. Oh. Oh. Gonna have a right old lump on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Hosh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. When peeling me back, all right. I know, that's what's worrying me. Some decent stuff. Probably be going now. Come on, we should get out of here. We're looking good in here. Assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. All right, in that case, we're fighting. Hush, Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way, neither you get killed. Goddamn liberals. Eh? There's a few more of them turning up. Damn, my big mouth. Okay, let's deal with them. Last chance! Look out on the left! Here come the friends! Oh, we got more coming from the trees there!
fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this lot was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss.